Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Crystal. For those of you who are new here and on this channel, I talk about all things fashion and lifestyle. If you're not new, then welcome back, girl. So in today's video, I have a fashion video for you guys. I'm going to be sharing with you guys some ways to style leather. Leather is probably one of the biggest trends of 2023. I actually think leather is just kind of like a, a basic and like an essential every year. But this year is just kind of like it's you know coming with the bang like leather is everywhere so i thought i would share with you guys and style up some of my leather pieces or faux leather because you know leather is expensive girl and we balling on a budget over here so i'm gonna be sharing with you guys some faux leather pieces slash leather pieces i guess you could say i'm um, just kind of give you some inspiration in case you love leather and you're looking for some style inspo as far as how to style it so yeah i'm gonna be sharing with you guys seven outfits so let's just get into the video <laughs> For this first look, I um, absolutely love it. You know, you can't go wrong with all black. Um, one of the biggest leather trends, um, this is kind of like a trend under, you know, underneath the trend, I guess you could say, is leather on leather. So just head to toe leather. And so that's kind of like what I did with this outfit. Um, the top is a shirt, like a shirt jacket or a shacket, and it's faux leather. I got that from Zara several years ago. And then I have on, as far as the bottoms, I have on some, um, some faux leather joggers. I think I did a whole video about how to style faux leather joggers. I'll link it up here, put it up here for you guys if you want to check it out. Um, but I just love these faux leather trousers or faux leather um, joggers, I should say. And I just thought this outfit looked really cute and really chic. I further kind of add a little bit more texture because it is leather. So I just wanted to add a little fun to the look. So I add like this little faux fur or like shirling. Uh, little vest on top just to kind of you know add a little something extra to the look because I felt like I felt like it needed something extra and also to kind of go with the sporty vibe of this look I just put on my um, Adidas Sambas these are super old but these are trendy now I'm so glad I didn't get rid of these y'all like yeah I just don't know how long I've had these shoes and almost got rid of them so and now they're everywhere and can't nobody get a hold of them so just go to show to hold on to your stuff um, but anyway, like I said, to kind of go with the whole sporty vibe of this look, I just, you know, paired it down with some sneakers to kind of make it more of like a casual look, more of like a, you know, running errands type of the look. And then to further add a little bit more, you know, fun to the look, I also paired um, this handbag, this little um, pouch bag that I got from Amazon. It's in this um, zebra print and um it's from amazon so yeah so i love this outfit oh and the sunglasses are old they're from shein so but i just love this outfit i just thought it was really you know casual and very chic and you know just very on trend for you know 2023 so yeah you guys let me know what you think about this outfit and yeah we'll get into the next one all right so for this next look this is really fun just really cute and just very preppy i kind of wanted to incorporate leather into like that preppy style um because you know when you think of leather you don't think of preppy right you just think of like edgy so i wanted to kind of again you know make this outfit a little bit or make leather a little bit i don't know preppy i guess you could say so um one leather piece that i have in this outfit or the only leather piece i have in this outfit is the leather shorts and I know what you're thinking, it's too cold to be out here with shorts. But where I live, I can get away with it because it's like in the 50s and 60s where I live. So I can get away with wearing some shorts. Uh, but of course, you know, it's just inspo. So, you know, you just dress accordingly because you can always layer up. But um, I love these other shorts. I got them from, I want to say Zara a couple of years ago. And yeah, I just love, I love them. They're just uh, kind of like oversized a little bit. So they're kind of baggy, so they're not like tight. Um, so I just paired these leather shorts with a blazer, like this um, plaid blazer that I got from J. Crew, and I love the color scheme of this, this green, this, this green and blue and black in it. So, and then I have on just a simple bodysuit that I got from Shein. The um, loafers are from Zara, and this handbag is from Just Fab, and my sunglasses are from Shein. So, just a preppy look. This is very much so preppy. Um, I also have on my Gucci tights too to add some warmth because you know it is winter time so you know you kind of want to you know cover up a little bit so you're not so cold so that's kind of why i chose the um these stockings or these leggings or tights 
um but i love this outfit it's just so like i said just a preppy look and just to kind of show you that you can make leather preppy so um but yeah i love this outfit you guys let me know what you think about it and yeah we'll get into the next outfit all right so for the next outfit i just put on one of my leather um trench coats that's another big huge trend now is leather trench coats or just trench coats in general but specifically leather trench coats um and this one i think i got from asos a, a while back and it's just in this burgundy color perfect for the you know winter season and um what i did i just styled up styled it up with a um shirt dress this is like a pleated shirt dress that i got from zara several years ago and then to add a little bit more fun to the look i also added a um like a little fringe bag just to kind of add a little bit you know a little color to the look or a little more color because the jacket is in this burgundy color and then as far as my shoes i just popped on these cowboy boots that are from they're from the brand jeffrey campbell but i got them from nordstrom and as far as my sunglasses just have like these cat eye tortoise shell sunglasses and um, these are from ego so um i absolutely love this outfit it's just a lot it's a lot of a little mixture of things but just kind of to show you that you can put an outfit together and it not be like super matchy matchy because i do kind of like to do matchy matchy stuff i'm not gonna lie i just kind of like to keep things kind of like in the same scheme or kind of some sort of theme but with this one i just kind of it's kind of a wild card look i don't know you, you guys let me know what you think about it i just thought it was something different you know a different kind of way to style up items but all the items are neutral except for the handbag so it just works um and then i have like some burgundy detail in the boots so again just kind of it just kind of works a little bit so but you guys let me know what you think about it i absolutely love this trench coat i actually have another one in like a camely color but i just thought i would go with the burgundy one just because I like, I just like the burgundy color, so. Um, but yeah, you guys let me know what you think about this outfit and how I styled up this leather piece as far as the trench coat. And yeah, we'll get into the next look. All right, and this next look, again, it's another, I don't know, you either gonna love it or you gonna hate this look, but I thought I would do another like leather on leather, but I would do it in a monochromatic kind of way with just color, because that's another theme or another trend under a trend um, as far as leather and that is colorful leather we're seeing a lot of colorful leather now and it's just you know all the bright colors um so i just thought i would incorporate like a monochromatic look styling up like some of my green leather pieces that i have so first up i have on this leather blazer which again you you need to have a leather blazer and this one is perfect i got it from nordstrom i think i got it a few months ago i want to say um, so I absolutely love it. I love this green color. I love green in general, like all shades of green I love. So I love this outfit. But you guys let me know what you think. I know it's a little wild card and it's a lot of green going on. But I feel like it it works because it's still green. So that's kind of how you can style up and make a monochromatic look. Just keep everything like in the same, you know, family as far as color wise. Um, and then um, as far as the um cardigan i have just have on this cardigan from ralph lauren i absolutely love it and then as far as the pants i have on these faux leather trousers they are from mango i got these a few years ago the boots are from zara and the handbag i think is from zara or mango one of it's like a shirling just to kind of add a little bit more texture this outfit is just full of texture you have knit you have leather you have a little bit of suede in the boots and then you have the shirling so just a very interesting look you know it's definitely not one of those like subdued look it's very interesting and there's a lot going on it's just very visually interesting i want to say so and then i also have on some sunglasses from um ray-ban but I, I love this look you guys let me know i know it's kind of out there a little bit wild card but you guys let me know what you think about it but i absolutely love it and yeah definitely definitely gonna wear this because i never would have thought to put all these pieces together but i don't know they just work but you guys let me know what you think about this outfit so all right so we'll get into the next one all right the next outfit again i'm styling up some colorful leather so i have on these leather trousers that i just recently got from Abercrombie and Fitch I actually bought two pair of these I just wanted to try out their leather um, pieces or their leather trousers since I hear so much good things about them so I was like you know I was intrigued I was like let me let me find out for myself so um, I went and got two pair actually two colors um, this one is like a chocolatey camel it's like a mixture between chocolate and camel not really chocolatey color and not really camel it's kind of like a mix like a 
what do you call it cognac kind of color um so yeah so i love these trousers and so again i love the preppy vibe so just kind of kept kept it kind of preppy again i have on a button-up shirt a navy blue button-up shirt that's from ralph lauren and then i just layered on a um like striped a navy striped knit that i also got from ralph lauren and then i have on just some basic white sneakers they're no name they're from just fab just to kind of again like i said i wanted that kind of preppy vibe and just very casual so this is something that i would wear to run errands or something like that um then as far as the bag i have on just a coach bag to kind of go with the brown of the pants they're two different colors but it's still okay and the, the bag the handbag is leather so you know to kind of go with the whole colorful leather thing um i just decided to go with this leather handbag so um and then the sunglasses they're super fun these are i think they're from shein i think i don't know they're really really old i don't know where these are from but i thought just to kind of go with the blue in this outfit um, but yeah, so I love this outfit. It's again, a, such a me outfit. Very, you know, casual, very chic, very preppy style, very old money style. And, you know, just to show you can do that old money style too, just, you know, with some leather. So, um, absolutely love this outfit. Definitely a me outfit. Definitely something that I would wear. You know, if you didn't follow me, you know, this is definitely a me outfit. So, uh, but yeah, so you guys let me know what you think about this outfit. And yeah, we'll get into the next one. All right, this next outfit is really fun. I really love this outfit. And with this outfit, it's just, again, black. But the as far as the leather piece, I went with this faux leather skirt that I got from Zara. And it has, like, a little split in the middle. And it's just a nice, voluminous leather skirt, you know. Get out your leather skirt, girl. This is the time to be wearing your leather skirt. Leather skirts are just a huge trend right now. So I love this one from Zara. And um, to make this more sporty, I put on a black hoodie, just a plain black black hoodie. I think I got this from H&M a few years ago. I'm not sure, maybe last year. Um, but yeah, it's just a plain black hoodie just to kind of go with it, just to kind of make it a little bit more sporty. And then I popped on some, just some boots these like Chelsea boots and they have like a little green sole. I have like a green sole to them. And um, this coat I have on, it is from Mango. I just recently got this. Um, I wanna say a couple of months ago I got this. I love this coat, this houndstooth coat. And I have on a, just a little bag that I got from Amazon and some, you know, some sunglasses that I also got from Shein. So just a very chic, I think this is a very chic and very sporty type look. That's just kind of one way to, you know, wear your skirts um, with some, it's just with like a, you know, a hoodie. I think that's a cute look. I think it's a very sporty look, especially if you're not, if you want to wear skirts and you don't want to be too feminine with it, then you can always just pop on a hoodie. I just love that combination of like a hoodie with a skirt. I just think it just works and it just makes you look really feminine and really chic um, without doing too much, if that makes sense. Like you look feminine, but you also look a little bit, you know, sporty too. So if you're into two looks, cause that's me, I'm kind of feminine and I'm kind of sporty. So I like to combine the two and just make, you know, you know, some, a very interesting outfit. So, um, but yeah, I love this outfit. This is definitely an outfit that I plan on wearing really soon. Cause I really love it. And so glad I came up with it. And um, yeah, you guys let me know what you think about this outfit. And yeah, we'll get into the next one. <laughs> All right, and this is the last outfit and actually the outfit that I have on right now. And um, I just wanted to style up a leather model jacket because I feel like everybody has a leather model jacket. Like these to me, these to me are just like essentials, like wardrobe essentials. They're nothing that, I, they're nothing that I feel like go out of style. Like I think model jackets are always in style and always come around in the winter time. And well, at least in the fall and the winter time, I should say. Um, so this one, again, to go with a colorful, Actually, I don't know if you want to call white a color, but anyway, um, just to kind of go with that whole colorful theme, I guess, or because when you think of leather, you think of what, like dark, right? But this is a cream leather moto jacket that I just recently got from, I think I got it from Nordstrom Rack. I also got it in a black and I absolutely love it. I love the detail on it. And so just kind of, just kind of like a cream and a blue vibe going on here. So I just have on this chunky um, like little turtleneck that I got from she or not she and I got it from H&M I got it I got it in several other colors too and then I have on these trousers these are from I think I got these from a brand called Commence and they're just like pinstripe you know blue and it has like some cream in it to kind of bring out the cream um, in the top part and then I have on my New Balance sneakers um, I can't think of the name of these 
but they're the ones that are super trendy right now and they have blue in them so that's kind of how why this outfit kind of works so it's just kind of like blue and cream basically is what the theme of this outfit is my glasses are from i think mango and then my handbag i think it's from ego so yeah just a cute just you know neutral look you know styling up you know a moto jacket just you know put you on a nice you know little turtleneck and some trousers and some sneakers girl and you have yourself a casual chic look it makes it casual because of the shoes so the shoes makes it casual so definitely gonna try to wear this outfit before it gets too hot but um you guys let me know what you think about this outfit so yeah that's it all right guys thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video um let me know down in the comments which outfit was your favorite which outfit you're feeling the most and yeah i hope you got some inspo and just get out there and just start styling up your leather pieces like don't just don't let them sit in the closet or don't wait for a special occasion like i hope this video shows you that you can you know style up some of your leather pieces in multiple different ways you know and it may be you know maybe inspire you to try to go out and find you some leather pieces that you never would thought to wear like a leather skirt or leather shorts you know or leather um trench coat you know so yeah um let me know again which one was your favorite i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did don't forget to like and subscribe because it definitely helps my channel out and yeah i will see you guys in the next video all right bye guys